do you see? Chanting. It's faint, but I recognize Mordran's voice. like a trap. and blood, death and birth. Turn this man from beast to earth. Modron, stay your blade, or die at my hand. I should have known Kunon wouldn't have it in him to quarter you for the dogs. It's a cold bitch who throws her lover to the wolves for her own crimes. 
You understand so little. No matter. Let me enlighten you with the fury of the gods! Then, leave Gloucestershire in the hands of that Christian, and for what? Your name and some trade routes? Do you doubt the power of your guards to sway the mind of a man? Teftar is no longer the seller you believe him to be. A man will lie to save his skin. When you are gone, he'll gut me and burn my people. The gods showed me this. Kunan spoke of your vision. The Nordnir spin their fatal threats, but without your plan, his heart would remain unchanged. Then I have no regrets. But I had a vision of you as well. One of a path that twists like the river owls. A seer spinning twist limb. She was fighting to protect her people, but she ground. I spared Kunan. Say your goodbyes and keep out of my sight, witch. Mother? What is this? Is this... Are we in hell? No. We're in England. How are you feeling? I feel well. <coughs> but it's a little fragrant in here, is it not? You will live to be Elderman yet, Tefter. Despite the many attempts on your life. Attempts? Untimely? You're safe. And the ceremony will proceed. Your wounds should heal by the next moon. If you get some rest. Then you have my thanks, Mother Modrin. Lovely woman. Utterly terrifying, though. Let's return with this. This cave is a place of nightmares. <laughs> 